Hey you guys, welcome back. It's time for the last tutorial of the series in how to create your MetaHuman. I'm going to be showing you guys how to complete your character. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, let's go ahead and move on to proportions. And you see you have a variety to choose from. You can choose the body style to be average, short or tall. All the proportions are the same, no matter if it's short, average or tall. Keep in mind that no matter which object you choose, it's going to affect the entire look of the body. That includes the face, the hands and the feet. So for example, if we choose this, she's gonna look super bulky. Let's go back to this. And then if we choose this, you see how the weight affects everything from her arms to her face as well. I do want this character to be more petite, so let's go ahead and give her this body style. And I'm gonna move this to a negative 54 so that her head is somewhat proportionate to the body. Keep in mind that while you're making these adjustments, the head is going to change. Make sure you adjust your head scale so that your character doesn't end up with a bobble head. If you do want your character to end up with a bobble head, you're just gonna go ahead and push this all the way up to 1.0, and there you go, you have a bobble head. All right, let's go ahead and bring that back down to a 0 0.54, again, negative 0 0.54. Next up, we have the top. So you see I've already made some adjustments, um, but you can do whatever you like. You can choose the color, and you can also change it and add a fabric. It's pretty cool. If you want to change the style of the shirt, you can then go to style and change it to what you like. Again, there's only a few options, so hopefully they'll update this in the future. If you want to just change the pattern of the sleeves, you can add a secondary graphic or secondary fabric, just like that. You also have the option of adding a graphic and it could be anything you like. As of now, there's not an option to import your own graphic. Um, hopefully we'll be able to do that in Unreal Editor or in Unreal Engine um, and you'll be able to create your own clothes for your character. So once you're done picking your top, you can move on to the bottoms and it's practically the same. You can choose your style and there's just a limited variety at this time. So there's two different types of jeans. You have some relaxed cargo pants. You have some um, yoga pants, as well as full length yoga pants, uh, shorts, as well as some um, chill slacks. You can change the color of the pants. And for some pants, you're actually able to add fabrics as well but I don't believe you can add graphics to the pants. Next up is shoes. And again, with the styles, you have flip-flops, you have your regular classic flats, you have running shoes, casual sneakers, your awesome loafers, Oxfords, as well as these cool boots. So I put the boots on there for her. You can change the color and style of each of these items. Um, Again, the options are limitless. You can do whatever you like. I believe certain shoes you can add fabric as well. And that's it. We went from top to bottom on how to create your character. If you notice that the eyes have changed once you adjust your proportions, just go back to the eyes, go to iris and select a different Iris style and go back to the style that you had. It's gonna switch it right back. And there you go. You created your first character using the Meta Human Creator. I don't know about you guys, but she sort of looks like the actress that played Mary Jane in Spider-Man. What do you guys think? All right, and there she is. All right, so now that you build your first character, how do you feel about it? Drop those comments below. I would love to hear it. 
Plus, thank you guys for participating in this tutorial. I hope you can see how easy it is to create your own characters. Be sure to check out my channel as well for more tutorials, music, Fortnite customs, playtesting, and more. Other than that, I'll see you guys on the next video. Keep it positive and keep it safe. Bye.